So this bread is more like a pain de mie in French, but in English we can call it sourdough loaf bread, I guess. It's a perfect bread to eat for the sandwich, of course, and also you can eat with sweets. It's totally fine, like chocolate, peanut butter, whatever you want. It's super nice. But for this recipe, I just wanted to make it like a zebra, so using two different colors. You can use whatever color you want, but for me, I use this special blue powder coming from flour, so it's 100% natural and it's pretty nice. So I start weighing the ingredients. I always put the liquid first and then I put all the rest of the ingredients. You will have the recipe in the description of the video and you can make it at home if you want. Then I'm gonna mix in the first bit to mix everything together for about 3 minutes and then just after I will go for the second speed for about 7 minutes. So after mixing, the temperature should be about 24 to 25 degrees. And straight after, I just take the dough, I just divide in two equal parts, and I take one of them, I just add the coloration powder, and I just mix again for about two minutes in the first bead only. Then after this I have two dough with two different colors, I put them in a container and I just let it proof for about one hour. After one hour the dough has risen quite a lot. At this point what I'm gonna do is just give more strength to the dough, so I need to round it, make it more tight. So for this, for the shaping, I made a video where I teach you how to shape baguette, how to shape loaf, bread, round. So I say everything about it, I just put a note on the top, you can click on it and watch later. Once I made a round with the dough, I just put it back in the container and 30 minutes rest again. After 30 minutes, the dough has proved quite a lot also again, but this time I just take them out and I'm just gonna use the lamination because I don't want to do it by hand, so it's pretty easy. But if you do it by hand, you just have to make the dough at about 4 to 5 mm. Then what I do is just, I put one dough and the other one on the top, I just roll together and I'm gonna do two different shapes. So one will be like this, I won't touch it, and the other one I'm just gonna cut it in the length and I will just mix the two parts like you can see in the video. Then I just put them in the tin and I just let it prove for about 1 hour 30 minutes at 26 degrees. After proving, I put some egg on one of them and on the other one I just put a cover, something very heavy like this. When it's gonna bake, it's not gonna come out from the tin. Unfortunately, I forgot to show you this. After baking, you can see I have two different shapes. One is more like a square, not really a square because my tin is not a perfect square, but you understand, and the other one. I'm 
pretty happy with this recipe and the final product is super nice. So first I cut in half the square one and I just show you inside how it is. It's pretty cool actually. If you want to impress your friends, just go for it. You can use any color you want. You can have red, green, blue, black, everything is possible. Then I cut the second one, which I shape differently. And let's see how it is. And you can see it's super nice. Also, I tried this bread and they're super tasty. Like I said, it's perfect for the sandwich. It's perfect for the breakfast. It's just super nice bread. And the color is just fancy. It's just to make it nicer to impress people. That's all. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. You can subscribe and like it to help me. Hope to see you in another video. Ciao.